It was a dark and stormy night when Sarah, a young journalist, embarked on a journey to uncover the truth behind the legend of the scary trucker. According to local folklore, the scary trucker was a vengeful spirit haunting the old highway, seeking retribution against anyone who dared to cross his path. As Sarah delved deeper into the mystery, she encountered eerie tales from truckers who claimed to have encountered the ghostly figure on lonely stretches of road. They spoke of a phantom truck that would appear out of nowhere, its headlights piercing through the darkness like glowing eyes of malice. One trucker, Jack, recounted his chilling encounter with the scary trucker. He described how he had been driving late at night, his headlights cutting through the foggy darkness, when he suddenly saw the ghostly truck materialize in front of him. Its engine roared with an otherworldly sound, and its headlights bore down on him with an intensity that froze his blood. But just as Jack thought he was doomed, the phantom truck vanished into thin air, leaving him shaken but unharmed. He swore that he could still hear the ghostly laughter of the scary trucker echoing in the night. Sarah's investigation led her to the old highway, where she hoped to capture evidence of the scary trucker's existence. Armed with cameras and recording equipment, she ventured into the darkness, her heart pounding with a mix of excitement and fear. As she drove along the deserted highway, a sense of unease crept over her. The wind whispered through the trees, and strange shadows seemed to dance at the edge of her vision. She couldn't shake the feeling that she was being watched, that something unseen was lurking just beyond the reach of her headlights. Then, without warning, a pair of glowing eyes appeared in her rearview mirror, a phantom truck, its headlights blazing with an otherworldly glow. Sarah's heart raced as she realized that she had stumbled upon the scary trucker himself. But before she could react, the phantom truck vanished, leaving behind only the echo of its haunting laughter. Sarah knew that she had witnessed something truly terrifying, and she vowed to uncover the truth behind the legend of the scary trucker, no matter the cost. As Sarah delved deeper into her investigation of the scary trucker, strange and inexplicable occurrences began to plague her. She would wake up in the middle of the night to the sound of phantom footsteps echoing through her empty house. Shadows seemed to move of their own accord, and objects would inexplicably shift places when she wasn't looking. At first, Sarah dismissed these incidents as mere coincidences or tricks of her imagination. But as they continued to escalate in frequency and intensity, she couldn't ignore the nagging feeling that she had stirred something sinister by delving into the legend of the scary trucker. Determined to unravel the mystery and capture definitive proof of the paranormal, Sarah enlisted the help of her friend and fellow investigator, Alex. Together, they set up surveillance equipment in key locations along the old highway, hoping to catch a glimpse of the elusive ghostly truck. Their first night of surveillance yielded nothing but eerie silence and the occasional howl of the wind. But on the second night, as they reviewed the footage, they caught a fleeting glimpse of the phantom truck, a hulking, spectral presence that seemed to defy the laws of reality. Excited by their discovery, Sarah and Alex continued their stakeout, venturing deeper into the heart of the haunted highway. But as they delved further into the darkness, they realized that they were not alone. Shadows flitted at the edge of their vision, and whispers echoed through the night, taunting them with cryptic messages and warnings to turn back. Undeterred, Sarah and Alex pressed on, their determination fueled by a mixture of adrenaline and curiosity. They knew that they were on the verge of uncovering something extraordinary something that could shake the foundations of their understanding of the paranormal. But the closer they got to the truth, the more dangerous their surroundings became. Unseen forces seemed to conspire against them, leading them into traps and luring them deeper into the clutches of the scary trucker's domain. One night, as they set up their equipment near an abandoned truck stop rumored to be a hotspot for paranormal activity, they heard the unmistakable rumble of an engine approaching. But there was no visible source for the sound no headlights piercing through the darkness. And then, with a bone-chilling certainty, they realized that they were surrounded by a fleet of phantom trucks, each one identical to the legendary scary trucker's ghostly rig. The engines roared with an otherworldly cacophony, and the headlights bore down on Sarah and Alex like the eyes of a vengeful spirit. In that moment, they knew that they had trespassed into the realm of the scary trucker himself, and that their journey was far from over. The true horror of their investigation was about to unfold, as they faced the wrath of a supernatural force that defied all logic and reason. As the fleet of phantom trucks surrounded Sarah and Alex, the air grew thick with an oppressive sense of malevolence. 
The engines of the ghostly rigs roared with an otherworldly fury, their headlights casting twisted shadows that danced eerily in the darkness. Sarah and Alex stood frozen, their hearts pounding in their chests as they faced the terrifying realization that they were at the mercy of the scary trucker and his spectral convoy. The phantom truck seemed to pulse with a malevolent energy, their ghostly forms exuding a sense of ancient anger and vengeance. Just as Sarah and Alex thought they were doomed, the engines of the phantom truck suddenly fell silent, and the headlights dimmed to a faint glow. The oppressive atmosphere lifted slightly, replaced by an eerie calm that was just as unsettling. Then, from the darkness emerged a figure clad in tattered overalls and a weathered trucker's cap, the manifestation of the scary trucker himself. His eyes gleamed with a cold, otherworldly light as he surveyed Sarah and Alex with a mixture of curiosity and malice. You have trespassed into my domain, the scary trucker's voice echoed like a chilling whisper. Few mortals dare to seek the truth behind the legend, and even fewer survive to tell the tale. Sarah, her voice trembling but defiant, spoke up. We only seek the truth. We want to understand what happened to you, why you haunt this highway. The scary trucker's spectral form seemed to flicker, as if considering Sarah's words. Long ago, I was just a man like any other, he began, his voice carrying the weight of centuries. But I made a pact with dark forces, seeking power and revenge against those who wronged me. As the scary trucker recounted his tragic tale of betrayal and damnation, Sarah and Alex listened with a mix of horror and fascination. They learned of a dark ritual gone awry, of souls consumed by vengeance and bound to this earthly realm as tormented spirits. But as the scary trucker's story reached its climax, a new threat emerged, a malevolent entity that had been manipulating him from the shadows, using his anger and pain to fuel its own twisted agenda. The entity revealed itself in a burst of dark energy, its form shifting and morphing into grotesque shapes that defied description. It spoke with a voice that echoed with ancient malice, taunting Sarah, Alex, and the scary trucker with promises of doom and destruction. Realizing that they were facing a force far beyond their understanding, Sarah and Alex knew that they had to act fast. With the scary trucker's help, they devised a plan to banish the malevolent entity back to the depths of the underworld and free the tormented souls it had ensnared. But as they prepared for the final showdown, they knew that their lives hung in the balance, and that the true horror of their encounter was yet to be revealed. The battle against the malevolent entity would test their courage, their wit, and their determination like never before, as they fought to survive in a world where the line between the living and the dead had blurred into a nightmare of unimaginable proportions. As Sarah, Alex, and the scary trucker prepared for their confrontation with the malevolent entity, they knew that they faced a formidable foe unlike anything they had encountered before. The air crackled with tension as they made their final preparations, each of them steeling themselves for the battle ahead. The malevolent entity loomed before them, its dark form pulsating with unholy energy. It laughed mockingly, taunting the trio with promises of pain and suffering. But Sarah, Alex, and the scary trucker stood united, their determination unwavering in the face of such evil. With a nod from the scary trucker, Sarah and Alex activated the artifacts they had brought with them, a relic of light, a symbol of courage, and a token of unity. The artifacts glowed with renewed vigor, imbued with the power of their wielder's resolve. The battle that followed was a whirlwind of chaos and fury. The malevolent entity unleashed a barrage of dark magic, sending tendrils of shadow and despair toward Sarah, Alex, and the scary trucker. But they countered with their own arsenal of abilities, combining their strengths to create a shield of light and courage that repelled the darkness. As the battle raged on, Sarah and Alex noticed something strange, the scary trucker's demeanor seemed to shift, his anger giving way to a sense of remorse and regret. He spoke of the pain he had caused, the lives he had destroyed in his quest for vengeance. Sarah, sensing an opportunity, reached out to the scary trucker, offering him a chance at redemption. It's not too late to make amends, she urged, her voice filled with compassion. Together, we can banish this evil and free the souls it has trapped. The scary trucker hesitated, torn between his desire for revenge and his longing for redemption. But as the malevolent entity launched another devastating attack, he made his choice. With a roar of defiance, he joined forces with Sarah and Alex, channeling his newfound sense of purpose into a powerful counterattack. 
The combined might of the trio proved too much for the malevolent entity, its dark form crumbling and dissipating into nothingness. As the echoes of battle faded, a sense of peace settled over the haunted highway, the tormented souls finally finding release from their eternal torment. But the victory came at a cost, the scary trucker's sacrifice. In his final moments, he thanked Sarah and Alex for showing him the path to redemption, and he urged them to continue their quest for truth and justice in his absence. As Sarah and Alex watched the spirit of the scary trucker ascend to the afterlife, a sense of closure washed over them. But they knew that their journey was far from over, and that new mysteries and horrors awaited them in the dark corners of the world. Their encounter with the scary trucker had changed them, imbuing them with a deeper understanding of the paranormal and a renewed determination to face whatever challenges came their way. The legend of the scary trucker may have ended, but the legacy of courage, unity, and redemption lived on, guiding Sarah and Alex toward their next terrifying adventure. As Sarah and Alex processed the events that had transpired, they couldn't shake the feeling that there was more to the story of the scary trucker than they had uncovered. They delved deeper into their research, scouring old archives and interviewing locals who had lived near the haunted highway for generations. One elderly resident, Mrs. Jenkins, shared a chilling tale of her own encounter with the scary trucker many years ago. She spoke of a night much like the one Sarah and Alex had experienced, when the phantom trucks roamed the highway and the air was thick with a sense of dread. According to Mrs. Jenkins, the scary trucker had once been a kind-hearted truck driver named Samuel, known for his generosity and willingness to help others in need. But a tragic accident had claimed his life, leaving him trapped between the worlds of the living and the dead. As Sarah and Alex pieced together the fragments of the scary trucker's past, they realized that his descent into darkness had been fueled by grief and a desire for justice. Samuel's spirit had been twisted by anger and despair, leading him down a path of vengeance that ultimately consumed him. Determined to honor Samuel's memory and uncover the truth behind his transformation into the scary trucker, Sarah and Alex set out on a new quest. They visited Samuel's old haunts, retracing his final moments and seeking clues that would shed light on his tragic fate. Their journey led them to an abandoned truck depot on the outskirts of town, a place rumored to be haunted by the lingering presence of Samuel's spirit. As they explored the decrepit building, they encountered eerie phenomena, objects moving on their own, phantom footsteps echoing through empty corridors, and the faint scent of diesel fuel lingering in the air. But amid the paranormal activity, Sarah and Alex discovered a hidden chamber filled with old photographs, journals, and personal belongings that belonged to Samuel. They pieced together his life story, from his humble beginnings as a young trucker to the moment of his untimely death on that fateful night. As they delved deeper into Samuel's past, they uncovered a shocking revelation, a conspiracy involving a rival trucking company, shady business dealings, and a cover-up orchestrated to protect powerful individuals at the cost of innocent lives. Sarah and Alex realized that Samuel had been a pawn in a larger game, his death a tragic consequence of greed and corruption. But his spirit had refused to rest, clinging to the material world in search of justice and closure. Armed with this newfound knowledge, Sarah and Alex vowed to expose the truth and bring justice to Samuel and all those who had suffered because of the dark forces at play. But little did they know that their investigation had caught the attention of sinister entities lurking in the shadows, entities that would stop at nothing to silence anyone who threatened to reveal their secrets. As Sarah and Alex delved deeper into the conspiracy surrounding Samuel's death, they encountered increasingly sinister obstacles in their path. Mysterious figures lurked in the shadows, watching their every move, and strange accidents seemed to befall anyone who tried to uncover the truth. Undeterred by the threats, Sarah and Alex pressed on, determined to bring justice to Samuel and expose the corruption that had led to his demise. They reached out to whistleblowers and anonymous sources, piecing together a web of deceit that implicated powerful individuals in the trucking industry. Their investigation led them to a secret meeting of the conspirators, where they overheard plans for a cover-up and the elimination of anyone who posed a threat to their operation. Sarah and Alex knew that they were running out of time, that their lives were in danger, but they refused to back down. Armed with evidence and a determination to see justice served, Sarah and Alex prepared to confront the conspirators and reveal the truth to the world. But as they gathered their allies and prepared for the final showdown, they realized that they had underestimated the lengths to which their enemies would go to protect their secrets. The night of the confrontation arrived, 
cloaked in an ominous darkness that mirrored the sinister intentions of the conspirators. Sarah and Alex, accompanied by a small group of trusted allies, infiltrated the secret meeting, armed with cameras, recording devices, and the truth that would expose the corruption once and for all. But as they confronted the conspirators and presented their evidence, a chilling realization dawned on them, the malevolent entities that had been watching from the shadows were not human at all. They were supernatural beings, drawn to the darkness of the conspiracy, feeding off the fear and suffering of the innocent. A battle erupted as the supernatural entities unleashed their dark powers, twisting reality and turning the once secret meeting into a chaotic battleground. Sarah, Alex, and their allies fought bravely, their determination fueled by the need to protect the truth and honor Samuel's memory. But as the battle reached its climax, a figure emerged from the shadows, a spectral manifestation of Samuel's spirit, his eyes filled with a mix of sorrow and determination. He spoke of his desire for justice, of his longing to find peace and move on from the torment that had bound him to the earthly realm. Sarah and Alex realized that Samuel's spirit held the key to defeating the malevolent entities and bringing closure to their ordeal. With his guidance, they tapped into a hidden reservoir of strength and courage, channeling their energies into a final, desperate assault against the supernatural forces. The confrontation culminated in a blinding flash of light and a deafening roar, as the darkness was banished and the conspirators' secrets were laid bare for all to see. But as the dust settled and the echoes of battle faded, Sarah, Alex, and their allies realized that their ordeal was far from over. The malevolent entities may have been defeated, but their presence had awakened other dark forces lurking in the shadows, forces that would stop at nothing to claim vengeance and plunge the world into chaos. And so, Sarah and Alex knew that their journey was far from over, that new horrors awaited them in the darkness, and that they would need to remain vigilant and united in the face of the unknown. As rifts between worlds began to tear open and malevolent forces seeped into the world, chaos and darkness spread like a plague. Sarah and Alex, along with their allies, realized that their victory against the dark entity had inadvertently unleashed a greater threat, one that threatened to consume everything in its path. The malevolent forces that poured through the rifts took on various forms, shadowy creatures that haunted the night, whispers of ancient evils that echoed through the land, and anomalies in reality that defied explanation. Sarah and Alex knew that they had to act quickly to stem the tide of darkness before it engulfed the world. Their first task was to close the rifts and prevent more malevolent entities from entering the world. Drawing on the knowledge and artifacts they had acquired during their quest for the key of equilibrium, they devised a plan to seal the breaches between worlds. But closing the rifts proved to be no easy task. The malevolent forces that had crossed over were relentless in their assault, attacking anyone who ventured near the rifts with ferocity and cunning. Sarah, Alex, and their allies faced constant danger as they worked to close the breaches, battling hordes of dark creatures and navigating treacherous terrain. As they fought to restore order, they discovered that the malevolent forces were being led by a powerful entity, a being of pure darkness and malice that sought to plunge the world into eternal night. This entity, known as the Shadow King, had been imprisoned in a realm of eternal darkness eons ago but had found a way to break free and unleash its wrath upon the world. Sarah and Alex realized that defeating the Shadow King was the key to restoring balance and closing the rifts once and for all. But the entity was cunning and elusive, striking from the shadows and manipulating events to further its own dark agenda, 